Hey you guys, I'm Marta Geek. In this video, I have an unboxing and hands-on look of another mobile controller. This time, we're going to show you guys the controller from G Story. Of course, everybody's making these type of controller. Every brand, it seems, is making one. So why not G Story make one? Uh, they've been, you know, very popular for making accessories for PlayStation, Xboxes, PCs, Nintendo Switches, and they decided to go ahead and make a controller. And here it is. They sent me this so I can try it out, make a video for you guys so that's what i'm doing in this video um here mobile game stretchable controller i don't know why they had to put the stretchable there but it's there <laughs> and over here in the side says hall hall joystick hall effect triggers uh trigger a thousand high hertz rate wired and wireless and multiple vibration over here in the back you see a little bit on how it looks the specs and some of the features of the controller but let's go and take this out now the cool thing about this it actually feels good in your hands and it's also not expensive not expensive at all regular price for this controller is actually around 59.99 and right before i started making this video i saw on amazon there's like a 10 dollar coupon so that means you can actually at this moment get this for 49.99 so honestly that's pretty good uh keep in mind you can use this controller with xbox game pass uh, uh nvidia you know luna steam all those cloud streaming services playstation now playstation now no yeah let's go and check this out so here it comes with some free thumb stick grips you can apply there if you want and here the packaging is very simple so it's just the controller and instruction manual and that's it so this is how it looks um right away I'm, I'm telling you right now when you get this out of the box if you've been trying a lot of these different controllers in your hands you will notice right away that this feels really light like if you've been following my channel you know that i've done videos for a whole bunch of con mobile handheld controllers and this one of of all of them this is one of the lightest one that, I, that it feels in my hand now this could be a negative thing for some people for other people might be a blessing for me i like when the controller actually feels a little bit more has a little bit more weight to it because it makes it feel for me it makes it feel a little bit more premium but these are very very light okay um the triggers the hall sticks these are hall effect sticks they feel really damn good the same thing goes with the triggers and the bumpers the bumpers and triggers they do feel really really damn good here the rear programmable buttons they're more into the grip over here and i think they also feel really good very responsive and when it comes to this the stretchable you can fit up to a 6.9 inches smartphone you cannot fit an ipad mini so if you're thinking for a controller for ipad mini this is not gonna fit it just goes up to 6.9 uh, this right here is a 6.8 inch screen the pixel 8 pro and of course since it has usb-c um, it will fit there it has the case which is a thin case and i can see right there it takes it barely fits it barely fits so if you have a thicker case than this it's not gonna fit okay but it does of course you could use it without a case but some people actually do prefer to have controllers that you can actually put your case but if the case is thin yes it will fit like this one if it's thicker than this one definitely you're not gonna fit when it first recognizes your phone attached to it it actually you will feel a vibration going on this little light turns on you have the function key right here which lets you actually you press it and hit the triggers and actually switches the triggers from like fps mode to racing mode on both sticks um has these button right here the d-pad over here feels pretty good the buttons are actually they actually feel like mechanicals so if you don't like mechanical buttons you're not gonna like these but they do feel really good and responsive and other than that you know of course um, here if you need to charge your smartphone while you're playing uh, you could just put the USB-C cable here and it will start charging the the smartphone while you're playing also if you want to use this wired you can use it wired 
Uh, all you have to do is just plug it here and plug it to the PC. And yes, you can play video games like that. If this, if you don't want to use a smartphone and, and you want to play on the PC, yes, you could just plug a cable there and connect it to the computer and it will actually work as well. Other than that, I did play a couple video games here on with this controller and the controller does feel really good. Like I said, the thumbsticks, the triggers and the bumpers actually feel really good and responsive. Of course, I'll leave links in my descriptions just in case you're interested and reading a little bit more about these controller. I like that it's white. It also comes in black as well. So if you're looking for a black controller, yes, you can get a black controller. Uh, this game, this controller does not have a launcher like other controllers, like the backbone and, so, and all that, that you could press like a one button and you'll see like a game launcher. Uh, it does not have that, but you know, you could just make your own folder like I do. And if you want to launch a game, you just go ahead and press the buttons there it'll just start launching the game. But yeah, this controller does not have its own unique launcher. Uh, other than that, guys, uh, there's nothing more to say about this. The only thing that I can say is that it works. It's actually pretty good, pretty functional. Uh, the buttons and triggers actually feels really good. The stick feels really good. D-pad feels good as well. I don't think we're going to be doing any fighting games here on with games here on the Android devices, but it, they do feel good. Other than that, guys, I'll finish the video with a couple gameplay that I did using this phone and this controller. So you guys can see how it performs while you're playing those video games. Okay, guys. So thanks for watching this video. Like I said, I'll leave links in my descriptions for this controller. If you're interested, you could read a little bit more information about it, or you could go ahead and purchase it from that link. Thanks for watching this video. Till next time, guys. Bye-bye.
gears. Get away from me! Out of my way! Move it. Move it. Out of my way. Looks like there's no more. Watch your engine. 